Rebuke me. Correct me. If I'm out of the word. I ain't crazy. No, no, no. I'm saying. I know what you're saying. <laughs> now, get those out of Listen. Thank you. Why do we say that? Because we have to agree. Now, we might be not be in the unity of the faith yet, but we're in the unity of the spirit. I don't know everything Brother Lindsay stands for. And there'll be some things about beard. I don't like the white shirt, and I think you ought to get another haircut. Hey, I don't understand. I'm ugly. As one of you as ugly as I am, all I can do is try to stay clean. I'm serious. <laughs> I'm serious. Well, I do love that word, and you love the word. Otherwise, you done lickety split it out of here. How many trinities have booted out of here every night with just this right here? Not much of the word of that. Everyone hit that door. And doing this to cover themselves in the trinity. Well, you go on and burn, devil burn. Somebody said, what about brother so-and-so? He was a great man of God. He was trinity. You say he's going to hell? Like a bullet. I said, like a bullet. You shouldn't say that. I ain't judging. The word judges. But we've compromised the word so much, that little sinner on the back row, he don't know which ends up. You try to one thing, then you slap hands with the Trinity and over there, and he thinks, okay, you go follow the Trinity over there. He may like the way he sings. Yeah. And they don't know which ends up. They're so confused. The Lord has mingled the perverse spirit in the land. And we don't know what's truth anymore from other things. I'll tell you right now. The Lord who up there and one is going to break down these denominational barriers. He's going to break down these independent barriers. And all these so-called, I'm great, I'm the man of God. And the uh, prophet gets up here and says, well, I, I cast out 10 devils yesterday. And, but then I get up here and say, well, I cast out 15. And he gets up and says, well, I forgot 15 minutes ago, I just cast out 20 devils. And then I'll come back up here and I'll say, well, I cast out 25. I just forgot about it. Come right back to me. And we try to one-up each other. Hey. We, if, if, if we can't condescend the, uh, the men of low estate preferring our brother above ourselves, we will never be used of God. But we don't hear that. We think there's one piece of pie, and if you get that piece of pie, then I don't get it. No, that thing's eternally world deep down there in infinity, and there's enough piece. You get a piece, you get another piece, and I come down. Now God's going to double those pieces and multiply the seeds and multiply my reward because I'll yoke up with you. Now, whose church is it? It's God's church. Let him be the federal head of it. Let the Holy Ghost rule in there. Somebody says, open pulpit, you're asking for trouble. You ordain elders in that church. Tell you what you do. You ordain elders in that church. You let the brethren come together over and have a central meeting place over and just try it. Just try it. Just try it. And don't make any difference if you're black or if you're white or you got the KKK. KKK come, comes in, we'll deal with the KKK too. I'll guarantee you better watch what you put your hand on, you KKK man. God will kill you. I'm serious. Hallelujah. And then you watch God move and how good it is for brethren to dwell together. How good it is. Now you've done good. Somebody said, God don't care about what I do. Oh, yes, he does. The whole book of the search, of the, of the revelation, over there, the first thing he says to every one of them, I know thy works. He didn't say, I know thy faith. He said, I know your works. Faith without works is dead, being alone. But we've got, the, we've bought into this lie that faith is all it is. Faith plus nothing is, is salvation. That's a lie out of hell. Jesus is, Jesus is looking for perfect works. By those works will faith be made perfect. And that's in the day of perfection and the day of perfect. And charity is a bond of perfectness. Hallelujah. Until I can love you, your faith goeth exceedingly, and the charity of every one of you abounded one toward another. Brethren, we're bound to thank God for you and all your tribulation and persecution that you endure, which is a manifest token of the righteous judgment of God, for that you might be. I said, I ain't going through nothing. Well, then get saved and you will. Are we okay?